day, everybody. Welcome back to a Rustic Ridge Farm with me, your host, Dilhelm. Hey, I hope you're all doing well. Uh, hey, if you haven't smashed that uh, subscribe button yet, uh, maybe think about it. We have uh, doubled in size <laughs> in the last 28 days. So you can be a part of some super fast growth. How's that? Is that is that enticing enough for you? Hopefully it is. What do we got here? A rerun of cool chocolate cake. Oh, queen of sauce. You make such delicious things. Chocolate cake. Very tasty. <gasps> the finest cake you've ever laid eyes on. I mean, look, I don't really necessarily care how it looks. Does it taste good? That's really more where you got to focus. You'll need a lot of sugar. Well, <laughs> sign me up. All right. Fortune teller. Oh, perturbed. Uh-oh. Weather report. Cloudy and beautiful. Okay. Uh, Marnie's birthday is coming. What do we have here? Lots of crops. Some ready. Okay. Have some espresso. I need another shed to make more espresso. Like, this is a thing in our life that we need. Hello, Jen. Good morning to you. Alrighty. And have this. You're seriously the best. I wonder if Jen will grow up to be a farmer like you. I don't know. Maybe that'll be Stardew Valley too. Like, the dynasty continues. You know what I mean? That'd be kind of fun. I mean, maybe that's not how it'll be, but you never know. I was cleaning some stuff out and found a thing. Okay, cool. We got a bream. All right, that's not really what he said, but whatever. We'll just go with it. Okay. Okay, now, what crops dare to be ready? Maybe the corn, huh? It could be the corn. Put all these away. We'll make some stuff with that eventually, don't worry. Probably in winter. What do we got going on in here today? Oh, just fruit, huh? Okay. And is that our first mango? Is that what I see? Hello, mango, mango, mango. I'm gonna take you to Leo. That's what I'm gonna do. That's where you're going. You're going to Leo, whether you like it or not. That's right. Oh, it's eggplant. You know, I tried eggplant on a couple occasions, and um, I have to say, not a huge fan. Um, yeah, just not, just not a huge fan. Uh, it was pretty good though. At the there's a a Chinese restaurant uh, near me that has mango and um, not mango has eggplant, and uh, that was pretty good. But I don't know what they cooked it in really um like the sauce or anything but it was pretty tasty and i liked it here we go get all of our delicious super tasty fairy rose honey um excuse me friend you don't go there all right, we're going to warp ourselves back up to the top and uh, drop a few things off because our inventory is fairly full. And uh, we need to make some, make a little bit more room. Just just a, just a scoosh. That's a fun word. Scoosh. Yeah. No, not that one. This one. There we go. And then over here. Then we sell these. There we go. Now we can say hi to the animal friends. Hello, animal friends. Good morning to you. Hello. Hello, all of you. Have you been super productive today? Wow, you were. All right. Meaning I just didn't pick up your stuff recently. That's, that's really what that means. All right, so that's full. Truffles everywhere. Oh, yes. I was going to say, where's our third pig? Like, I feel like the pigs are slacking off over here. The three pigs. We only got like 
four truffles. Come on now. Come on now. Oh, I lied. I spoke too soon. There has been more a truffleage. There we go. Oh, man, we got grapes. All right. All the grapes. What do we need the grapes for? Absolutely nothing. Why did I plant them? Just to have them. I mean, I don't really need them for anything. But, hey, that's okay. Okay, over here, put all the stuff in here. Look at all the things that we put away. Oh, so nice. 37 truffles. My goodness. Do we have a goat milk floating around? Uh, there's one. There we go. Uh, a couple duck eggs. We got some duck eggs. Duck eggs. There we go. All right. Um, we have a wool. Yeah, we got some of that. And uh, a truffle. We need a truffle. And we'll take all these feathers with us over to the island. And we're going to sell all those today. Yeah, I think that'll work. All right. You go there. You go here. Nope, there. And then, uh, then we're off. Uh, my nose is a little stuffy today. I'm very sorry. So if you hear me kind of sniffling a little bit, uh, I apologize in advance. It's just allergies. Oh my goodness. The pigs are just being extra productive now. How many truffles is that today? Like nine or something? Okay, we have to go catch one more stingray on the island. And we have to earn another million dollars. That's that's what we're about. We're about that million dollar life. That's right. We, uh, we gotta get it done. And then we should probably think about decorating our house on the beach, on the, on the beach, on the island at some point. Um, which I've not done. You would think that eventually we would get a lobster, wouldn't you? Like, you would just think that that would be a thing, huh? Just make sure that we don't need any more of that. Okay. We haven't gotten one yet, though. All we need is a lobster. It shouldn't... You know, it really shouldn't be that hard. You know what I mean? It should be... <clears throat> it should be pretty easy, but... Um, it is not to be. Hang on a second. What we... Okay, what do I do with them? Oh, we just have to catch them? I don't have to, like, keep them in my inventory or nothing? Oh, well, I don't trust that, so... <clears throat> we'll just leave that as it is then. And uh, move on with our day. Um, did our... It did wear off. Hey! We got things to do here. How dare you run off, Mr. Super Speed. You know what else we need <clears throat> is um, uh, to find Leo. That's something we need to do. There he is. I love this. I'm going to put it in my nest. Sorry, I'm shy today. Okay, well, that's you can be shy. It's okay. Ba -ba, ba -ba, ba. Alright, we need one stingray. That's what we need. <clears throat> just one. Just, just, just the one. Just the one. That's all we need today. Alright, here we go. Fishing time, friends. Fishing time. And we still need a Neptunite and a prehistoric skull. Uh, that is also something that we should get around to having. Wow, I am not awake enough for this. 
Hopefully this is the fish that we need and then we can be done with this. That would be awesome. Come on then, let's catch you. Let's do it. We got him. There it is. Do 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 do. We got it. And we got one piece of bait. Oh. The glorious bait. Nothing like tropical fishing to keep the art alive. Here we go. And there is our reward. We got it. Okay. Let's move right along. Did we look at the options available to us at uh, the Super Challenge and, and just nope out of that this last episode? Is that what we did? I feel like that's what I did. But see, here's the thing. I don't remember. <laughs> because that was like five days ago when I recorded that. And um, my, my brain doesn't always go back that far in memory. <laughs> yeah. All right, prehistoric skull. Uh, I would love for you to show up when I break one of these open. Huh? Come on now. I know it's a lower luck day, but you could be generous game. It's happened before. Or we could get ribs. That's... Okay. It's not really what we want. But all right. That's all right. To the farm. Is this really a shortcut? I ask myself sometimes, but I guess it is. Okay, so we got all those done. We don't need that. Oh yeah, we don't need these. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, let's put the duck feathers in there because we're going to give those to Leo. <clears throat> is an important step. Um, yeah, I, I suppose we can run up to the volcano real fast. I don't see anything else down here that we really need to do. Uh, well, now that I say that, we can run over here and see if there was a challenge to think about doing. Little bit more coconuts in our life. Uh, nope, nothing there. Okay. Uh, wow. Um, I'm not a fan of either of these, honestly. Um, we could maybe do this if we hit a high luck day and we brought enough bombs. Uh, so we'll grab that, although... <clears throat> yeah, we'll just leave that as it is. I, I have tried that one before and not succeeded. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's a thing. Oh, yeah, just beat the heck out of us. My goodness. That slime really took it to us right there. <laughs> that slime's like, So you think you are good at the game? I will show you you are not good at the game. And then he just beat the heck out of us. That's how that went down. He had the accent and everything. Look at you being all by the shoreline twice in a row. There we go. Come on over, little friend. Oh, wow, we didn't get anything. We got nothing from that except that we have to eat food. <laughs> That's all that we got. <clears throat> well then. Okay. Hello, fireball friend. Could you become a dead fireball friend and give me some crystal things? Huh? Wow, I didn't drop anything. That's 
just sad. Maybe we should maybe we should have eaten a lucky lunch. Okay. Anything of notes in here? Keep running out of speed. I'll just want to be faster. Hey, I'm okay with fighting these guys. Bring it on. Give me the shards. Give me your shards, sir. There we go. Can't even get in. Oh, no. Yeah, you can over here. Okay. Die. There's a chest over here that I saw. That's why I wanted to get over here. Do, do, do. Every time I see that dwarf scroll now, I'm going to think of Hemi. I was streaming this the other day, and uh, she ended up in this spot where... Another... Another ring? Another coffee ring? <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> anyway, no, she needed a dwarf scroll. Sorry for that. Throat cleaner. Uh, she needed a dwarf scroll to uh, give to her fish to uh, make them happy so that they would have more fish in the pond. And um, she was just like, really? Really? You want a scroll? <laughs> it was really funny. I, you never know what the fish are going to want, you know? They're, they're in a world all their own. Oh, a digger. A chest? Cinder shards. Well, how nice of you. All right. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going here. I'm just running around the volcano trying to... Well, I guess trying to make it to floor five, I think, is what we're doing. Too far. There we go. Oh, iridium. Well. Oh, no. Ah! We're being chased! Hey! 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 Listen. There's stuff we're trying to do over here. Wow, three. Three iridium. All right. Please, dragon tooth. Darn. It wasn't to meant to be. I was hoping. I really, 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 really need two more dragon teeth. And uh, they're just really hard to get. They are hard to locate and find and all of that jazz. Okay, some more of that. Alrighty. Well, I think we're at the point now where we just kind of run, huh? And hope that we don't have to hit any buttons. <clears throat> no more buttons. No buttons. Button, 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 buttons. We don't want buttons. That's four. We're running low on time in the day. Okie dokie. Let's go over this way. Get chased by some fire guys. There we are. Glorious. No. Oh. Uh, you know, hang on. Before we do that, 
We can buy bombs here. Uh, we should maybe try to save for these uh, shoes. Yeah. Should we buy some bombs? Like, we are going to be going into the caverns, right? So... There we go. We'll just spend like 100,000 on bombs. It's all good. And then we'll go to the farm. Yeah, and then we'll uh, hopefully make it to the bed in time. Mm hmm. I say hopefully. Uh, with great purpose. Because we're not going to go to that bed. We're going to this bed. After we drop off a few things. There we go. We'll take those as a few things to drop off. Uh, do we have coffee? Yep, look at that. We've got some coffee. Very good. Oh, 140. Plenty of time. Whoop. Hey, look at that. We made some money. Yes, the delicious berry rose honey. And the truffles. Let's not forget the valuable, valuable truffles. From our lovely pig friends. We're just finding truffles all over the place. Oh, dear. We're going to pause here for just a second. Well, I'm going to keep talking, but um, my battery in my headset is dying. And I don't know about you, but I like to be able to hear the game when I'm playing it. <laughs> Makes it easier, doesn't it? So we're just going to switch out that battery. I have an Arctis uh, 7 Pro wireless headset, which has uh, two batteries. Two battery packs. Um, and uh, you just switch them out when the time comes. Then you pop the other one into the, the base station and it charges up, and there you go. It is Marnie's birthday. We should probably think about doing something for her. Albacore, very nice. Fortune Teller reminds us that the spirits are neutral and the weather report today is raining for tomorrow and beautiful and sunny for the island. Alright, here you go, Abby. I love this, you're the best. I was just admiring the mermaid's pendant you gave me. I'll proudly wear this to my grave. Oh, well. That's a long time, but thanks. Jen, how are you today? Good morning, little child. Ah, so cute. Oh, lots of cranberries. Uh, take this special fish tank. It will make it grow. Oh, a deluxe fish. Wow. Okay. <clears throat> uh, is that bigger than our current fish tank? Oh my, it is. Um. Can I? Is there anything else that we toss in there? Okay. Now then, can I? I can. All right. So we're just going to center this on the wall as best we can here. There we go. There. Deluxe fish tank. Oh, yeah. That's what we're talking about. Okay, put that away. Let's read the note. As a boy of 10, my father gave me a glow ring and a magnet ring that never left my fingers. However, when I was standing on top of the volcano, a strange idea came over me, took my rings and cast them to the forge, and behold, they were one. Now I've got a glowing magnet ring. Oh, I hope old Pappy doesn't mind. I hope so too, because at that point, they were your rings and you should be able to do with them as you chose. Plus, you know, he's probably not around anymore, so... Um, I, I don't know that he's going to mind one way or the other. Okay, where... We don't have any wood still, do we? Gosh. Gosh, we don't. Okay, well, let's put this extra... Some of this extra stuff in here. Uh, the, I think we can sell everything. We don't need two, two rings, do we? I don't feel like I do. 
anyway. Uh, but I think there's a spot for them inside. Like a ring chest. There. One bonus ring that we're not sure we need. Okay. That seems great. What's here? We have more bombs? We do. More bombs, more bombs. All the bombs. All right, let's also bring the life elixir. What do we need to make more life elixirs? Where are... There we go. Oh, I passed it. Okay, lots of mushrooms. We're going to take care of that as well. Yes, we are. Um, and since we are going to go... Let's... Yeah. So no fishing today, no watering, no axe. Okay. We're going to... No. Yes, that's where we want that. We're just going to throw all of this stuff over here. We're going to put the healing items down here. And then we're going to pick a bunch of crops. Because Pam, I am sure, is not yet ready to go over to the Skull Cavern. We have to make it to level 100. We're going to try and do it without stairs. We'll see if that works out for us. We may die. Which would be kind of lousy. But, you know, these things happen. Picking all the cranberries. So many cranberries. I would really like more uh, iridium sprinklers up here, honestly. Sort of get a couple more spots to plant some crops in. You know? Uh, would be nice. I would be all for it. Oh my goodness, there are so many cranberries. They just, they just never end. They just keep going. Well, the cranberries start coming and they don't stop coming. You gotta harvest them all. That's right. <clears throat> it's like Pokemon, except you're not really catching all of them. You're just harvesting. Okay, so let's see. What do we need? We need red ones. We need morels, antrails, green. I don't. I don't even know. What we're, we're just. You know what? Here, just grab all the mushrooms. Okay, and we will make as many as we can. Let's just do it that way. What are we out of? We're out of purple ones. Okay. Well, we made a lot. You know? There's there's a lot there. 16 is a significant amount, I feel like. Will it be enough? That is a different question entirely. Let's just put that over there. Oh, we don't have our pole on us. Well, the only thing we're going to pick up today are truffles. I just cleaned all those up, pig. My gosh. Oh! I'm not sure what happened there, but we knocked it right off the hinge. We closed it with great vehemence. All right, let's throw that in there. Put that away, put that away. Where do we put our fishing pole? There it is. Let's just organize these things quickly. Okie doke. And we can sell those. There we go. And Pam should be just about ready to go. Perfect timing. What are you telling me? Yeah. Okay. Level 100. <laughs> we are probably not going to survive this. It's good to have realistic expectations. And the current realistic expectation is... Um, a lack of survival. That's that's where we're at. 
I will, however, pick up all of these cactus fruit, which are worth a lot to me. All right. Oh, boy. A hundred. Wow, we're almost dead. goodness. So it's going to be like that, is it? make a noise. He just straight up charged. Oh, man. Oops. Oh, boy. This is ridiculous. How does anyone survive this? I don't know. That's just crazy. game. I just want to go down the staircase. <laughs> We've made it down eight levels in three hours. That's not going to help. Nothing else, we gotta get some entertaining resources out of this, right? Some geodes, anyway. Come on. Yeah, they just take forever to die, you know? Waste the bomb here. We're just gonna hope there's something over here. No? Oh goodness. That is unfortunate and not what we wanted to see. Run! Run from the slime. He's very fast. Run! Do not look back. Just keep going forward. Oh my goodness, I couldn't get out in time.
Oh, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks, Harvey. Wow. No, we lost all the geodes. Oh, the one thing we needed. Where am I even at? Are we in an event right now? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I'm sick of preparing samples. Oh, well. I mean, why did I come in the front door? I was already in the back. Oh, she dropped a sample. The whole sample's ruined. Harvey's going to kill me. Oh, that's hysterical. What should I do? Uh, listen, just uh, tell him it was an accident. You know, just just tell him the truth. It's okay. Uh, what happened? I heard something break. I dropped one of the samples. I'm so sorry. Thanks for telling me the truth. Don't worry about it. Uh, we'll get another one. Thanks for being patient with me. Of course. Uh, you've been a big help around here. I don't know what I'd do without you. Smile. You know what I'd do? You'll, you look a little pale. Are you okay? No, listen. I just, like, almost died. I should imagine that I'm looking a little pale, Harvey. Oh, a double event. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? This is uh, Dr. H at 52 North of uh, 43.5 East. Seeking aerial response. Anybody there? Copy that, Dr. H on the ground. This is Blackbird Fire Fire Zuzu. Uh, anything to report? Oh, someone's there. Uh, I mean, standard ground report. Wind at three clicks, 36 degrees north of west. Ground temperature, 42 crags. Humidity, 53%. Dr. H out. Yikes, my pulse is soaring. A bump. I like that we do this while we're all, like, pretty much almost dead. What a, what a great set of events. Hill! Hi, Harvey. Hey, uh, what's up? Oh, well, you see, I was just on the radio, and I made contact with a real pilot. Well, good for you. As a matter of fact, we can probably see him flying overhead right now. You know what I would like? All those Omni Geodes I just lost. Quick, get over here! Okay, wow, okay. Joel, Joel, okay, bossy. Look! Alright, I'm looking. There he goes. And he's off. Place is unknown. As a kid, my dream was always to be a pilot. But then you had glasses and you couldn't see. There you go. Yep, I know how that is. And a crippling fear of heights. Okay, I didn't used to have the fear of heights, but I almost fell off a cliff on a mountain once, and ever since, I don't like heights at all. <laughs> then the dream started to fade away. I identify with that. Harvey, I've been there. It's okay, don't be sad. I have grown to accept my station in life. It does take a while to get to that point, too. Not everyone can achieve their dreams. It's just the way the world is. I would say that not everyone's dreams are attainable by them. Like, I am not athletic, so to have athletically oriented dreams, probably not the best. I am very musical. Those were better. <laughs> Band, choir, drama. Yeah, that kind of thing. Hey, just let me show you some model airplanes. Oh, model airplanes. Well, do you have any, uh, model, you know, like, I don't know, a Bane blade? Uh, something with, uh, a Warhammer 40k sort of theme to it, do ya? No? Okay. Wow. <sighs> do we go back and try again? We could make it before the day is over. Although we'd only have like 8 hours to get 100 levels in and that's probably not gonna happen. Yep. That is... I don't think we're going to get that challenge done, friends. Um, I'm just saying, I'm pretty sure that's not going to work out for us. But it was funny to try, wasn't it? I knew that wasn't going to actually work out, but... I have always wanted to give it a shot. Oh, yeah, radioactive ore. See, that's important to have. We might need another chest down here. Um, here's the thing. We don't have any wood. <laughs> Still. Uh... Hey, a piece of wood. What do you know? We got a piece of wood. We did get another purple mushroom. Cave carrots. Yeah, see, we just have things that we don't need right now, like uh, these cave carrots. 
with sashimi. Okay. Let's put our good friends, the bombs, back where they came from. And, uh, did we put them in here? Yes. Let's just put those where they go. And, uh, if we can get back over there, I would love to go cut down some trees. Because I'm out of wood. And there's trees here. I mean, I, I think you see where we're going with that. I am really bummed out that uh, we didn't get to keep the Omni Geodes. I was it's a shame. You know, we could have lost like something else. Is that is that something that'll appear in the Lost and Found in Lewis's house? Can we go like purchase them or something from him? Is that a thing? Or like the Adventurers Guild or something? Where does that show up at? I feel like that's a new mechanic that I don't quite understand. Okay, what do we have here? Ten? No. Yes, I do want those. Do, 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 do. All right, we need, uh, is it bat wings, is it? Was this here earlier in the day and I missed it? Probably. I probably walked right by it and didn't even notice it. On the upside, we are getting some lovely amounts of wood over here. You gotta look on the bright side of dying in games, you know? There's almost always something that you can still get out of it. Sometimes what you get out of it is just learning more about uh, how the game works. Other times it's to run around screaming like a like a headless chicken and going, why, dear God, why did we even think that was a good idea? Which is perhaps more where I'm leaning right now. Hey there! Since we're here, I thought maybe I would invest in the island farm supplies a little bit. How's that sound? That should be enough for now. I would like a couple of seasonal plants as well. Uh, and that'll do it. Thanks, Sandy. Have a great one. Alrighty. Back to town. Well, look, we did sort of die, but, uh, we'll call it a not totally bust of a day. I feel like we've done all right for ourselves. And even, even with the dying... We've gotten more wood, and uh, we got some seeds to take over to the island. Um, tomorrow in the game is Friday. Oh, it is Marnie's birthday I still, I suppose. I should go look and see if she's over at the, uh, what's that called? That one place, the, the saloon. Yes, that's, that's what it is. We can take some stuff over there and drop it off. Um, all right, let's sell those. Yeah. Okay. Run on in here. Um, oops, I grabbed something. How dare you, Plum? How dare you not be Iridium? Okay, we're gonna we're just gonna sell that. You are not worth my time. Uh, do I have a truffle oil? I should, because I, I feel like I just made one. Yeah, there we go. To the saloon. Hi-ho, trotter away! There's more truffles down there. I saw them. Now, is Marnie... At the saloon on a Thursday. Or am I going to have to go to her house? Hmm. Okay, she's not here. All right. Well then. I see lots of other people around. 
None of them are the people that I would like to be looking for and finding. Is she in here? Ah, yes. Good. It's your birthday. There you go. This is great. Of course it's great. I made it myself on my farm just for you. It was a lovely, lovely thing. Okay. Well, there's more wood to be had. Now we might as well grab some of it while we're here. There we go. Get that wood. Uh, at least I can make a couple of chests now. Yeah. Find ourselves in need of a few. Could we clear out some of the ones that we already have? Sure. Will we? Maybe not. Wow, wild foraging uh, mushroom. That's not something I find all the time. Grab those blackberries. All right, horse. Another one. Well, well, well. We got some real trees over here that have grown, yes. Should probably jump into the secret wood and grab some hard wood, I suppose, since we're also over this way. Oh, that's right. The axe doesn't use any energy. <laughs> I forgot. We can literally chop trees all day and just be fine. Our character would be like, I am not tired. This chopping of trees does nothing for me. Hey, listen, we fought enough today. Okay, look, slime. You don't even know. You don't even know. The horrors that we have been through on this day of Stardew Valley. You, you just don't even know. I am really stubborn, though, and there's a part of me that wants to try that again, even though I'm pretty sure we'll still die. You know? It's uh, just how I am. Which is probably why when I really get into, like, a, a rogue light game, like, say, Hades, I just keep trying. <laughs> but I'm just too stubborn to not win at least once. That's a great, that's a great game, though, and uh, we have one, like, I don't know, like 10 times out of 51 tries or something? I, it's, it's, I feel like it's pretty good. I feel like we've done well. It's getting late. Listen. We'll pass out out here. I don't, I don't even care at this point. Like, we've already had a day. I need the wood. We have to make things... It's not that late yet. It will be later before we leave. Can we get three more trees done? I think so. I think we can get them. And then get the horse and still make it up to the house in time? I think we can. Alright, let's go. We have uh, an hour. Plenty of time. Now, here's why I say plenty of time. Because we don't actually have to ride the horse all the way up there. We can clip into the sprinkler instead. That'll be so much better for us. But we can do this. And then, boom, we're just here. Isn't that nice? Ah, glorious. With so much random stuff on us. Some of which I can't put away right now. A winter root? Where you get a winter root from? What's up with that? Okay. Things that are going to the island. Those are going to the island. Pretty much everything else isn't. Got a lot of things going to the mushroom chest. That's what we have. We got a lot of coffee in there now. That's good times. Ding. Okay. Uh, no. Uh, nope. Marnie is what we were trying to find. Marnie, where are you? Ah, yes, we have increased in uh, friendship with you. Good, good, good. Uh, who else is coming up? Oh, Robin is coming up. Oh, okay. All right, and George. Although I think we might have maxed George's friendship already. But 
Well, that was certainly an energetic and exciting episode of Stardew Valley, friends. Hope you enjoyed uh, our fun, super fun trip to Skull Cavern. We'll see if there's another one in the next episode. But until then, take care, everybody. Have a great time. Have a great day. Have a great week. And we'll see you on the next episode.